Hello, hello guys, and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial, guys, I will be showing you how to update your Visual Studio Code. First of all, guys, if you don't have Visual Studio Code on the latest version, I highly suggest you to go to their own website from here to Visual Studio Code, and then go here, and you'll find the latest version from the from there. So this the latest version, which is one point. 1.75 is available so the latest version which is 1.75 it is the last one that is updated to the moment so all you need to do is click on it and then it will show all the features that came with it and you can check it from here and if you want to download it just click on the download button which is at the top of the website other than that let's say that you have the program already on your pc and you want to check if there's any updates all you need to do is go to your web to your program and then go to help and then all you need to do is check for updates so they will show you that there is no update available so in my case there is nothing like an update available at the moment but for you guys uh, it will show that like if, if you have like an old version they will show that there is updates and all you need to do is click on install to actually update it and for those who really who like have an old version but when they click over here they have like there are no currently no updates available all you need to do guys is go to uh, cpanel and from here i highly suggest you to uninstall the software from here so search for visual studio code and then all you need to do is go to the website again and simply just go here and download for windows and it will be downloaded on the latest version so yeah guys once more to make you remember exactly what we did is the first step which is checking the version from here checking to the terminal and you can go here help and then you can check for updates and to know which version exactly you have you can just click on about and you will check whatever version you have for example for me i have 1.75.1 which is the latest version at the moment and you will have basically any any like informations about it and yeah that's it so thank you guys for watching if you have any other questions please leave them in the comment section down below and see you in the next tutorial